Hey everyone, this is Jenny Garcia and in this unboxing I am going to show the July kit from Studio Calico and also a few items that I got. They had a few kits for $10 and other special items for subscribers. So let's see what I got. So, oh, we got an email that now the new kit wasn't uh, coming in a pouch. It's kind of a bummer, but it is what it is. Let's start with, you know, I'm going to take the whole thing out, including the few extras. And I thought I added an extra... Nail, uh, alpha sticker of the nail sticker sheet. I didn't. Bummer. I really like these. And I was thinking about the ease. Uh, these come in the Traveler's Notebook Kit. And uh, I really love them. I love smiley faces. So I decided to grab a pack of those. And I also got the washi tape. Okay, let me open this. And let's see. This, this way. I thought it was really cute. Sort of retro. Very cute, and everything kind of goes together. I can maybe throw these things in the new kit. And these are frames, and they're acetate. They are from the Wonder Collection. And we have two of each. Very pretty. I love these. I am so glad I got these. They are so cute. Wanderlust and Explore. And I love that kit, the Wonder Kit, but I don't need any more travel items. When I was in the Everyday Explorers the creative team, they did quite a few collections for traveling, so I still have a bunch of those items but these are very good these I can use with everything so I got three travelers notebooks actually sorry forgot this which I already have you already seen because I use them in uh, actually I haven't uh, posted that um, project life video but this was only 50 cents and it has a few that I really, really liked. And this is something that I can add to my birthday kit. So after that, I got three Traveler's Notebooks kits. They were $10 each. And the reason I got all three of these is because of the washi and the stamps. I do love, let me see, I have these already. Me with my new these are acetate words and they have like a rainbow below. Moments, love, farewell, sweet, amazing, capture, hello, awesome, special, and ray. And these are super cute. So I love this stamp set. I just, I really love what the design team did with these little tags, and I really wanted those. So, honestly, with just the washi tape and these, like, I think 
I have my ten dollars because the washi tape is usually three ninety nine, and this one has like a clouds, like a serious cloud sort of vibe. Very pretty. We have these puffy stickers, which I already had because these came in the um, in the documentary kit. Okay, so let me shuffle things around. And these I absolutely love. I love both of these. I love the good alphas, and I like that these had numbers. So, and I love the colors. I think the ones that I have are like this coral kind of pink and these labels are perfect and I like that there's two sheets of those and then we have the Traveler's Notebook Honestly, love the stamp set so much and the rest of the items that I even didn't pay attention to the traveler's notebook it's very simple which I like I love this I love this page. A little something sweet, super cute. I love a notebook or a library card page. This is for like games, which I love board games. Notes. And then the end. I wish the cover was a little bit sturdier, but that's fine. And again, the whole thing for $10, I'm pretty sure that $10 is probably just this um, the Traveler's Notebook. And I, about the new changes, I, I get it, they're doing it because prices are up everywhere and maybe it's hard for them to keep uh, justifying the pouch. But I do love the pouch because then you can keep the kit together as long as you want. This kit, I already have the, the documentary kit version because I received the subscription and I love these alphas when I got them. I don't know if you can see them. They have like a notebook pattern, which I love. And then we have... I don't know if that's a mistake or it included two, maybe because it's single. I'm not sure, but or did I order an extra? Now I can't remember. But I love these labels. They're super cute. And I love the stamp set, which is like a stamp. It has like a butterfly and here are the facts. Good vibes only. All the little details and there's this Ginga my thing it's the name of this pattern I thought it was really pretty so as long as the stamp and the washi had me the rest was a bonus I love and I think I use most of mine of these little vellum die cuts I usually prefer acetate but doing vellum in these, let's see if I can put them on a white paper. I thought it was genius. So, I love the patterns and the cuts and they're so organic and they have leaves. And I feel like the patterns are a little bit different or maybe been a while since I use almost the whole thing. I know that there are a few of them that they're the same. It's just that this one in particular, I don't really remember. But I'm pretty sure it's the same. Let me put it back in the little 
uh, baggy because vellum it's a little bit more delicate than acetate but this was one of the decisions that like it's really pretty it doesn't matter if you pick acetate or um or vellum we have these which i love any kind of label round square all of them and now we have the traveler's notebook and i love the pattern on the outside and i like this one too it's kind to be kind it's funny because it feels this paper feels a little bit thinner than the documented cards Maybe because it's supposed to be less bulky. Oh, I love this. For people who like to like do nature journaling. Or this is perfect for writing. Like a whole side is grid. Well, almost up. Or it's like a journaling friendly kind of page. And I honestly love that. Memories. Currently exploring. And this is just like the washi tape. I think the washi tape is a little bit darker. Love this. And I love how the... Oh, this one's my favorite. This is so pretty. I love how the documented cards and the Traveler's Notebook are very similar. And if you get both... Um, subscriptions even though you're gonna get a few uh, duplicates especially I think the alpha sometimes are the same font but sometimes they're different colors which I don't mind I love alpha stickers but uh, it's like a very good it's nice to have those combos and you can combine them which is probably what I'm going to do I'm probably going to find each one of these uh yeah and this one is the love one this is from february okay so and the february kit i love that i i am in love with the documentary kit so I'm pretty sure that this one is just as beautiful and I was thinking that this was the washi of this kit because of the scallops, but it wasn't. And I was like, oh no, I can't believe And this was like facing down, so I didn't know I was going to get this one. And I was kind of bummed because I was like, oh, but what about that scallop washi? So here it is. We're good. Um, these are perfect to stamp in this kind of... Um, label sheet and i have a few colors of these and it's like it's a little bit i think the whole thing is an inch which i could like stamp this on um either vellum cork whatever and i can like use a one inch circle punch and then have my own little journaling pieces or i could make this like a very light pink and then put purple on top like there's lots of variations on that so i love this one i think there's two here but i'm not completely sure then i have oh and then i was confusing the other alphas for these and i thought that these were going to be the alphas of the year they usually have like a few styles that they repeat during the year i think nail was one of the styles from last year and then they have the one from um alpine valley so i don't i don't know but i love these and i think i have an extra sheet of these which is great and then we have these beautiful puffy stickers and i love the little ones i would buy a whole sheet of just these tiny little items that would be so cute and the, speaking of my debate between acetate and vellum 
This is another one that I think it will look cute either way, but they are acetate. They are gorgeous. And this also came in the documentary kit, and I do not mind having doubles of these at all. Okay. Oh. And they're gone. Really cute. And they have so many sizes and different shapes and patterns. I just love this kit. I love the documentary. And that's the thing about these kits too. That I love the documentary version. And someone gave me the idea that you could like cut off the pages from the Traveler's Notebook. And use them in your project life. Which is a great idea. And also what I've seen Nancy Damiano do is that she like takes them apart she just takes because this is not uh sewn this is staple if you go to the middle you can just take those staples out and reconfigure this as you want and i've seen people who are, are um sewing these back together which is something that if i was going to take them apart and redo it i would do it that way and i love this page this is so beautiful and i love these numbers too they look like um typewriter buttons playing this moment on repeat so great like a marble effect i love these retro rainbow colors and this um collection this month they had that retro uh, like 70s but 90s i've been listening to the, this book called the 90s and they were talking about how it, during the 90s there was like a look back to the 70s so this is the kind of feel that this notebook gives me and now we're doing like a double back to the 90s and I, I keep forgetting that it was long ago and that I was a child but that's that's something that I don't want to think about <laughs> I already feel old okay so these are the items that were on sale these kits were $10 each so I got my money's worth because I'm always like, I always admire pieces of the Traveler's Notebook or I look at the Traveler's Notebook and I think it's so beautiful, but my main love is Project Life. So that's why I will always subscribe to the documentary kits before I um, subscribe to a Traveler's Notebook. But this way I get to have both. Forecast Sunny and Bright. I love this and I like the idea of using the packaging too because I love this packaging. And in fact, there's one that I have on my desk. It's been there for a few months. That I just love the colors. But it's like a, one of these that you open and I have no idea what to do with it. But I think that I might do that. Especially with 4x6 cards that... We don't get as many as uh, three by fours. Okay, so forecast sunny and bright. Oh, I could have pulled this thing. Oh well. <laughs> and oh, and on the inside, I'm gonna open it without ruining this. Because I want to show you the inside. Because they have like, it looks like a cut apart. It's really cute. Oh my god. Let's see if I can open on one side and show. Oh, I almost forgot one part of my. I don't know if you can see that. Isn't it cool? It's like little items that you can cut. So I'm glad I didn't win. Like, <laughs> but I love that. It's really cute. It's 
So, this month, and honestly, I am in love with the uh, last few kits. I think there was a month, I think it was May, I want to say, that it was really weak. And a few friends of mine and I were like, I don't like this. I hope they're not, like, regressing. But the next ones after that have been amazing. And I think this one, if this one gets all the cards right, then it's going to be my favorite of the year. So first we have these are, okay, what are these? I say your acetate. Let's see. Yep. Let me look at the back of this so i can spill them out these are so cute oh also by the way until the 31st their um digitals are one dollar except the monthly sheets these these are 1.99 these are not on sale oh this one got a little bit um damaged but i don't mind i i think it'll be fine but I wasn't planning to like show you this first, but since we're here and I got a few of those two because I won a $10 gift card from their Sweet 16 um, like participation things and stuff like that. And I was so excited because I had a few uh, digitals in my cart. Oh my God, I love Love, love, love these. I absolutely love these. These are so cute. They are all amazing. I love these. Summer is a state of mind. Living for summer. Love this journey. I want to see everything. Explore more. Time to explore the world. Get outside and keep on shining. I love these. Oh, and the, now that I see the fruit, I think the July Pipsticks kit is coming next week. Because they recently shipped, they shipped like in the middle of the month. And it's a bunch of fruit too, so there's like a fruit trend going on. And I like people who do like dopamine home decor, even though I can do it like that. There's a lot of people going like really hard for fruit, so... Oh, that's a trend. And I like these. There's a show that has this font in their title. But I don't know which one is it. Is it Cheers? I never really watched it, but I watched the intro a lot. I don't know. I I was the youngest in my house until my brother was born. So I watched what other people told me to watch. Okay, so we have those three. We have these labels which are my favorite labels in the whole history of Studio Calico. I love the colors. It looks like Andy's room. <laughs> Andy from Toy Story, or maybe it's me. I'm watching, I was watching Incredibles with my kids just right now, so maybe I have like Disney on my mind. Unless you see it, let me know if I'm not that crazy. Maybe you see it too. These are freaking cool. I... I, I don't even know who came up with this, the whole design, but please let's do more of this. I love it. I am obsessed with it. Just keep smiling, savoring these moments, wonder this right now. And then we have a few other blank and designs, so that's pretty awesome. And then we got summer. And I know that it's a very small space to um, journal, but I got the other day... The Tumble VIP box, and oh my god, this one is 00 0.5, and look how tiny it is. Okay, I'm afraid if I go way too close, you're not going to be able to see it, but it's so, so cool. Let me see if I can write something. I find that every time I use a pen, I write differently. Maybe it's just me. But this would be perfect for that. Okay. So, okay, I'll show you that. Let me show you the stamps. And the stamp is pretty cool. Um, I love the stamp. I love the sun. Um, 
but I don't know. It's a good stamp. It's really good. Is it my favorite? Not really, but it's really great. And it's not something that I'm like, ugh, this stamp set is like, I don't want it in my kit. No, it's perfect. It's just not my jam. Or now that I look at it and I think about, like, if I combine it with um, the one from the first kit with the little tags and I add these to the middle of the tags and I add this at the bottom. You know what? Never mind. I like it. <laughs> I changed my mind. Sometimes I need to like create a project in my brain to see, okay, how am I going to do this? How, how am I going to use it? Is it going to work for my projects? Which is fine. And then we have the chipboard and I like how these come with the holes punch for people that like to keep everything in albums to organize i'm not like that i do like a different thing but i i do love organizing so i can appreciate it <laughs> in my backyard every summer has a story or have oh happy day and we have the circles they're really really cute i would have preferred if the four if these four were also happy face but they're still pretty cute and then we have the cards let's open oh my god that's so cool Cool. Why can I say that? <laughs> okay, let's open them. Here are the cards. We have a bunch of pure white, but I feel that we have enough like of that peach that it will be it will make two different kinds of people very happy because I know there are people who like cream white and I know people who like white white and I am the white white kind of uh the scrapper I would say these are both very cute I like this I have no idea what it is but I like it and I can like stamp something here it's a weird design but I love it I love these for the days too this is like a cheetah summer this is so cute road trip let's have some fun Summer memories, take more chances, dance more dances. I like that. Summer. This hand-drawn, like, messy cherries. Part of the, and I'm seeing, like, a picnic sort of vibe going on, too. Oh, this is so cute. Oh, and the cards for this month are still regular price. I love that they keep adding these. Yes. Let's add one of these to each kit. Um, so yeah, the cards for this month are still regular price, they're not $1. Oh, I love this. It's the little, you can put like a circle in the middle and then put one of these uh, acetate. I like that, yeah. Oh, happy day. I love these summer days. I love journaling like lines so I love that we're getting lots of that this is so cute and it's also child friendly without being extremely cutie for people that don't have kids and don't like that kind of style beach vibes love this summer So again, it's a kit. Maybe it's a kit that was designed by a few different people that were like, no, that's too kitty. No, that's too white. <laughs> too much uh, white. I love this card. And I prefer cards that say the month, but they don't say the year because I am always so behind. By the time I get to July 2023, <laughs> I'm going to forget that I have that card. Okay, so all the 3x4s are really beautiful. Let's see the 6x4, and they are, they hurt me. <laughs> they use your telepathy. I love this one. I love how simple this is, like, more, less. Love it. Oh, this is perfect. This would be cute also for uh, those of you who do Spirit Week and suffer through it first of all a hug uh but maybe put in like little photos of the whole week of today's crazy hair day today's 
sock day or something like that. I obviously adore this. Keep moving forward. I love it. My favorite movie, one of my favorite movies is Meet the Robinsons and that's one of the the songs and quotes that they use a lot. So honestly, this kit is flipping beautiful. Is it my number one of the year? No, I'm going to say that it's number two. And the reason it's not number one is the stamp set. It's just that the stamp set of... Is it June the one that is my new favorite? I think it's June, yeah. The stamp, I liked it more. It's a great stamp set. I'm just being a picky pants. But it's perfect. Uh, my favorite item from this kit, let me see. This is so unfair because I I love the, the circles. I love the acetate. I love the labels and I love this one. And even though this has been like my favorite label set yet, I'm gonna go with this. It's just really cute. And the cards are also amazing. So it's an amazing kit. I love it so much. Uh, let me know what was your favorite item and out of the extras, which one was your favorite? I honestly can't pick one. I really like them all. I'm still bummed that I didn't get a second nail. I may have to check my email because what if I did? Who knows? Well, I uh, love all of these. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you're having a great summer if you are in the northern hemisphere and a great winter if you are below the equator. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you're having an awesome day. Bye!